what's up guys welcome back to another video in today's video we're going to be unboxing my brand new 2021 throne cyclist the goon 29er and also we have a special package from my sponsor origin Eight. i'm not going to do too much talking let's just jump right into this unboxing video Let me show you guys this packaging real quick. Peep, peep how they package this bike. You know, it's not, you know, too crazy. Nothing too crazy going on in here. Fits perfect, perfect size bike. Seems like everything is padded up well to prevent scratches. I mean, we're gonna find out when I take the bike out, but you know, from what I'm looking at now, like everything seems packaged well. save these because i am going to california next month and i'm going to need to package my bag my bike in a bag bike bag so it's good to save these when you buy a new bike and guys i know i'm looking like a black uh burnt corn dog right now but that's because i don't really have good lighting in here good lighting coming soon i promise peep, peep the new seat looks way more comfortable you know if you guys can see that I'll go outside and show you guys a better detailed video of the bike all right guys this is how the bike is looking so far I do obviously need to throw the wheels on throw the handlebars but I'm actually not gonna be running the stock bars or the stock brakes I actually need to go run inside grab the new brakes that I have for this bike because I'm running different brakes and I'm running obviously I'm always going to run Broke Boys BMX bars on any of my bikes because those are really the best bars in the game so I'm also about to go in the house grab those bars uh, I am going to be using the seat that comes with the bike off the back and already tell new things they did with this I cannot wait to discuss all of that with you guys but let's finish building this bike first bars make sure you guys don't cross thread the nut or it's not going to be tightened properly or you could have you know it could cause damage to the stem and even also the the bars like move as you're you know doing a wheelie or something so basically what i do is let me try to zoom in i start from the bottom top bottom top so left bottom left top right bottom right top left keep doing that try to do it like in an even way everybody has their own way of doing it but i try to do mine in an even way and then tighten go around tighten all of them and then boom you should be good if anybody want to purchase the stock bars dm me on instagram and all you got to do is pay for shipping but i'll definitely ship them out to you so just shoot me a dm on instagram and i'll definitely sh you know ship them to you Let me tell you guys something every time i buy a new bike it doesn't matter if i rode it never rode it never touched it it doesn't matter i always ding it somewhere like i'll drop something on it I'll drop the bike scratch the bike it doesn't matter it's just my luck let's jump back into the video look how they got this cardboard box protecting the free will I guess so it doesn't get like damaged during shipping. And the one thing I like about what Throne does, let me get this, let me get this crap off real quick. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, box components are the best brake systems for these bikes. Like 
box components brakes are very responsive i'm not being paid to say this they're very responsive you know they're not too strong they're not crazy strong but they got some power like they got some good stopping power for wheelies and stuff like that but you know there's some people out there that don't like strong brakes but definitely would recommend box components brakes on these kind of bikes so i'm gonna go ahead and get these brakes hooked up uh you know get them adjusted i don't really want to film too much of that because it's a timing bomb doing that kind of stuff i gotta shoot back in the house try to find some grease for the pedals throw the front rim back on throw the seat on adjust the seat and then we should be good for our first test ride unfortunately i do not have any more park tool or uh, grease so i'm just going to use this muck off multi-use crap you know it's, it's a lubricant it should be fine i'll make sure to go back and you know lube up the cranks and lube up stuff but for now this stuff should work you know it ain't gonna hurt for the first ride now you guys are gonna ask me what pedals do i use to save yourself from commenting in the comment section i usually run originate redox pedals these are honestly one of my favorite pedals in the game i went with red you know obviously it's a white and red bike these pedals are really really dope show you guys these are fire I'm really liking how the new seat let me show you guys focus 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 anyways I'm really liking how the new seat on these bikes came uh it looks definitely looks way more comfortable than the old versions um i can't wait to re i really can't wait to test out this bike this is how i have my seat in case you guys were wondering so i usually have it on those oh you can't see i don't know if you guys can see those numbers right there but it's usually on like 20 and like max so the left side of that uh, arm is on 20 and then the right side is on max, so. Alright guys, how's she looking, how's she looking? Bike's pretty much done, tighten the wheels, I need to tighten that brake lever, just need to throw some air in the tires, the brakes is rubbing a little bit right there, so I probably just need to adjust those two screws, and then yeah, we should be able to go for our first test ride. Alright guys, I just made it downtown. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. What you guys think about this bike. I actually love this colorway. I'm gonna try to not powder coat it, I promise. But yeah guys, Throne did not send me this bike. Let me clear that up now. I bought this bike. I bought it because I actually love the colorway of it. Like that white and red actually looks good. And I actually got a couple of ideas. I'm gonna try to cook up some stuff with ride out supplies, so y'all definitely gotta stay tuned for that. So I'm actually gonna go go ahead and take this bike for its first test ride, but I'm gonna end the video off here. You guys are gonna have to just stay tuned for the next video. I'm gonna you know go over some stuff, you know what are, what's different on the bike. But if you guys enjoyed today's video, please comment down below, like this video, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm on my way to 10,000 subscribers. Peace out.